Welcome back to The Legend of Dragoon. Yeah, I'm streaming. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, welcome back. It's good to see you all. Uh, thanks for your patience if you watch this live on Twitch.tv television. Slash Ustra Ahazu. That's this guy. Uh, more of this fantastic game. No. And our new companion, which is only in panties. Only panty companion. Yippee! Oh, that's a cool enemy. It's a viper, a dragonfly. Yeah. Good, he's still alive. Oh, he's still alive. Nice. This will hurt. Ooh, that hurt quite a lot. You just got the strangest compliment on the bus today? I want to hear that. What is strange to you? What is a strange compliment to you? Someone asked if I used to be a wrestler. Is that a good thing? <laughs> eh? <laughs> he thought you were looking like a Norwegian wrestler. wrestler. Like you, you resemble someone? You look like close to someone? I mean, you look like a little bit like The Undertaker, but I never yes. wanted to tell you this. No, you're not. Stop saying that about yourself. You're not. Spinning cane. Spinning cane. Oh, it was so fast. Yeah, I think it was great. You're working on, I mean, you know, there are always ups and downs in life, right? The problem, the, the only, the only thing we can do is, uh, work on them. And you never know. I know like the, um, too much beer in good times. Uh, it's also true. And also, I guess COVID happened and a lot of stress happened in your life too. So, and some people tend to go on like a killing spree for food to like douse their uh, stress so. yes. because it's like an easier relief than be active okay i'm always jealous of the people that when they're feeling stress or whatever they just go to the gym and like and like go ham on their body like yeah that would be better Oh, that's work. Just sitting around and eating, binging your favorite series, not not work. <laughs> chocolate ice cream and chips is your specialty. Yeah. For me, it's chocolate for sure. When I was in my when I was in my uh, when I was when I trained my job, uh, when I learned my job, uh, I ate one chocolate, like one entire chocolate bar thingy 100 gram of chocolate every day escapism yeah i mean then again we're gamers right i mean for everyone who especially i think this is like more true for the rpg people sorry um but we can very good escape into like a gaming world if things around us collapse right
You never did that before? Are you lying to me? Oh, you're on your way home to work. <laughs> we had payday beer. And played board games. Oh, that sounds nice. Cool. I hope you had a great time. You, ho you hop into your city building games. Mm, are you looking forward to City Skylines too? Sushi Go Party, Table Tennis, and Werewolf. Ooh. Cool. Erupting Chick. I, kn I knew a girl that had that nickname. Oh, uh, is Sid Skylines made with Unity? I had no idea. Oh. Oh, ah, uh, oh, oh, that's not good. That's not good. Any infinite game is good for escapism. Mm. I just replay Gothic too. Run around, sit in like sit in a store, drink beer with my character. Uh, you know, just hearing hearing the noises and like be happy. In the gaming world. I'm not good at like idle games when it comes to I want my I want my mind to shut up. I cannot buy like an infinite game or a city builder game. I need like someone to talk to me. Otherwise, the voices in my head will get too loud. Going goblin mode? Is that not something very different? I thought goblin mode is like something very different. Cannot carry more items. Hmm, don't want to heal though. I don't have that many heals. Throw out. He uses it when he when he shuts off. Okay. Like, I mean, The Sims, I guess you mentioned The Sims, that's something I can, like, I can super good, like, um, escape into, just because, uh, I, I will, I will, you know, I will, I will keep myself extremely busy during The Sims, like, I, I, I min-max my character all the time. A bunch of games like, po the Genshin, oh, I, I, I haven't heard of Genshin, like, in a long while, I wonder if there's an update right now. Pokemon, Shiny Pearl. Oh, so, oh, you mean like uh, what is made by Unity? The good thing is there's Pokemon games made by Unity. So I guess a lot of people hoping that Nintendo will uh, raise their finger on the Unity. No, 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 yeah, there's, there's Pokemon games that are made by Unity, yes, I, I, I read about that too. And again, a lot of people like praying that this is why Nintendo will maybe raise a finger on that. Unity has retracted everything and actually made it better. Oh! Oh, okay, so they basically Nintendo... Papa Nintendo doesn't need to step up. But the trust is gone. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I can see... I 
I can see it. I can see it that the trust is gone. That's why you had room to do Final Fantasy XIV. Ah, oh, I see. You like it? You like Final Fantasy XIV? Physical attack barrier, that's not good. Yes. That's a miss. Yeah, they will not like. Hmm, I guess I'll start with Unity now. Hopefully they behave now, hee <laughs> hee. Not big at MMO, okay. Just hate all the cutscenes. Yeah. I mean, the backtracking and stuff doesn't bother me because that's basically every MMO ever. But I'm, I'm also like on the fence, like why does every dialogue with every shit person in the entire universe like need a cutscene? <laughs> like I, wa I watch the, uh, you know, the cutscenes for the normal stuff. They're fun. They're very, they're very good made. Like it's it's very good made when they want to like you know voice acting and stuff. Everything I heard so far pretty good. But yes, so a little bit too much. I made fun of that. I mean yeah. Again, the community is nice. Also, I've, and also I understand why the community is nice. Like there's no there's no conflict in the game, which is I, which is something I don't like. Like in every MMO you play so far, you have like a conflict between like player factions or whatever. And Final Fantasy is like no, everyone is friends in here. I was watching a cutscene. There's like little dudes. Like I don't know how this race is called. Like little red people, and there was like a guard by these little red people. It's like a like a it's like a I don't know like a gigantic bull person. It's like double as high as a human and it's like yeah they're just standing together there's no like racism or criticism about them like is there really, really like a like <laughs> are these people okay are these real re gigantic people okay with like getting commanded by like mouse people are they okay with that they don't seem to be okay with that but they i guess they pretend to be it's so it's so strong it's so weird yeah, these people are like, go to your ankle. <laughs> I guess I get commanded by like, people that I can't barely hear because I'm 15 times as big. Huh? How to talk to short people and he's like, picking up this like, mouse first. But there's plenty of, bit, bit, there's plenty of conflict in the story later. Yeah, but not, not between each other, right? Yes. And this is what like of obviously makes the community nice. Because it's not like, oh my god, you're an alliance player, oh my god, you're a horde player, uh, I hate you, like, you, you don't have this kind of conflict. Potatoes, Lala, yeah, Lalafell, yeah, I guess that's the faction I was talking about, yeah, it's weird. It's not, it's not about hate, it's not about hating them, it's just like, why would you be commanded? Like, as a human, it's okay-ish. But again, there's this... What is this faction called? That is like, these big people? Like, they're, they're big, big and bulky people? Oh.
To be fair though, one could argue that the conflict in Verve helped contribute to the toxic player base. Oh yeah, yeah, of course, yes. Of course that is true. But I feel like the toxicity of the player base has like a whole different, uh, a whole different, uh, a whole different take. The toxicity of the player base comes from um, in retail, retail players, because retail, like in, in in classic, it's not that big. In retail, though, everyone thinks they like know everything about the game, and everyone, everyone who's like asking a question is just an idiot like why like most of the people that behave like shitheads they had never played like the first four or five expansions of world of warcraft never like you had to ask at some point because you as you experience yourself right now you don't know anything about the world you need to ask whether it's like farm is or whatever if you don't if you don't want to like struggle and that was a normal thing. There was no toxicity, but now it's like, oh my god, how could you not know that this like person is like there? Ah, oh, you dumbass. Like, oh okay. Baron Jet was always toxic. It's just horde for you, man. They're just dumb. Horde horde is just dumb. Hey Hana, good to see you. You can play a lot of Nostralia this before they came out with classic retail. It was hella toxic. <laughs> yeah. Good to see you, by the way. Good to have you back. Uh, and happy Friday, too. I don't know. See you in a sec, Sabo. Like you can, uh, but again, you can argue that most likely every MMO is, like, oh, sorry, every online game has a toxic aspect to it because people comparing their dicks. And this is why online games are toxic because people, people actually like measure their dick size in the open. There was like a legit gangster mob of dudes who camped the dino leather in Onguru. Oh man, what a, that, that, that are dicks. True. Bunch of assholes. <laughs> Anything that's competitive is prone to be, uh, to be at least a bit toxic. Yes. Like for example, but sometimes I don't understand like, you know, how hard it can be. Like for example, like we all know uh, one of the most toxic uh, games out there is League of Legends. According to Legend, uh, League of Legends is hardcore toxic, right? It has like basically no new game, n like no new player base because you can't play this game. You cannot learn the game because people will just eat you alive. And that's super sad. You play a lot of Apex. Oh, I play Apex too. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, I can totally agree with that. Like, like you cannot even ask if you want this, like, you know, if someone picks a character like, oh my God, I want to play this character. Uh, uh, do you like, do you mind? And like, fuck you. What are you wrong? Rah, 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 rah. I go, okay. <laughs> I, I was just asking. <laughs> Why is it that way? Or like people like, people like also like, um, hunt down um you know hunt down people after they get killed and stuff like this it's so bizarre to me like yeah you lose you're 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 was you were not that good you lose why would you like be toxic about it but get but just be better like the other person's not at fault that you're just too dumb to play the game but, like too unexperienced God forbid I talk on a mic after downing a team myself. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw like a video um, on Twitter the other day about Apex, where like a girl was uh, playing, and oh my god, 
the be again like I, I can totally see i can totally see why it is so hard for girls even if they're super good and you know it's gaming is like a mental skill like the physical capacity is not that big so there's a lot of very good talented gamer girls out there not throwing any shade it's true i see them and how people treat them is just disgusting period nothing else to add just pure utterly disgusting human behavior behavior some people are so nice though yeah i mean like of course you have nice people right starcraft was toxic oh really he was called an idiot noob. Every new, every name imaginable after that match. I never played multiplayer again. Ugh. You gotta focus on the nice ones. It's hard though. We all we all been there, right? It's like a super easy thing to say. Like yeah, just blend out the uh, the hate. How? How you do that? How you do that? Oh, where am I going? This is also going up. Is it going to the box? Oh, it's going to the box though. Huge. Oh, this is going to the cutscene. What a welcome! What a, what a welcome to go! Oh look! Is it a virage? Virage? Huh? What the heck is this? What is worse is it has a complete form. Guys, I'm asking you, what is what is it? <clears throat> it might be the real cause of the distortion of the valley. Wow, that's scary. Shana, here it comes again. I hear the voice again. Ignore the voice. Don't go. It's too dangerous to go. Yes, we gotta go. We're not gonna make it to the Garricks without going over this uh, thing of jamming. What are you looking at? You guys don't trust me? Is there no way but it is there no way but to advance? There is like a lot of ways and there's a lot of treasure chests too. I want all of them, so I will like back down. <laughs> I want treasure first. Thank you for sharing your stories on online gaming, by the way. Um very interesting topic. This is a topic that I can relate to. Again, I play a lot of MMOs sometimes. I you know I play Smite. Um and I play Apex, other stuff. I pretty much I play everything that um that piques my interest at least for a while. And even better if there's like a trial version or whatever. Always do that. Time flies by playing, yup. And I think Apex is an okay game to get good at. I like the variety of skills. I like I like the I like I like the how fast the game is. I like how the I don't know. There's just something There's a homey feel about the game, but it's still new enough to make me, you know, excited. Oh yeah, of course it has it's, 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 its own issues. No doubt in that. Hmm. 
My very first shooter was like Left 4 Dead 2. Haven't touched any shooter before that. If you, if you are nice to me and uh, you know don't count any like LAN parties, uh, Counter Strike 1.6, which I guess doesn't count as a shooter at that point. If you only do it like in your LAN party environment. Is he attackable again? Can <laughs> still count. <laughs> Fine. Hey, spinning cane is max. Good. I didn't know that Starcraft uh, Starcraft was that toxic to be honest. How can like a um real-time strategy game be toxic in the first place? Like how? This will hopefully grant me the chest up top and then the other way will grant me I'm not sure what it will grant me first way i was going oh it also grants me the treasure chest i see the night hell When Majesty attack SP is accumulated, that is good if it would be a Dragoon. So I guess it is for Ultimate. Yeah! Oh, so today I love Payday Apex. I mean, I don't count Payday as a shooter because it's not... I also like Warframe, by the way. Don't forget Warframe. But it's not like... Apex is fun, but everything else is like not competitive. I guess Left 4 Dead 2 was competitive for me. But Payday is, you know, you just play with your friends and you play. It's... Payday is a fun, good memories. We uh, played a lot of Payday 2 and we tried Payday 3 now, which just came out last week. It has a lot of issues right now with that we hope that they will uh, broom out and give, give us a good like payday experience hopefully i have oh i have so many hours in left for that too so many hours oh we're confused that's not good I hate that if a character is confused, he can make the whole party escape. What's that about? Huh? Why is he not fleeing from battle alone? I'm so confused, guys. I'm not even myself. I can I cannot feel my toes, but I guess we should walk away. Your, your group is like, okay. Very hard encounters though. They are relentless. Relentless strong encounters. Hey, 
Also, if I go like, if I enjoy a game, if it's online or whatever, I go super sweaty in it. As I, as I said earlier, like, um, yeah. um, playing competitive games for me is like, yeah, uh, not competitive, like it, 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 whatever it is. If there's like, if there's like a, a dick measuring in the game and I enjoy the game, I will, I will go, I will put it on the table. I will measure. That is for sure. You can attack him, that doesn't matter. This is why a part of me wants to get good at uh, Magic the Gathering Arena. Like, I guess magic in general, uh, uh, magic the gathering in general. I don't know. Because I was good in magic, and now that I haven't played it, like I, I haven't kept up with, you know, what's going on. Payday three sweat level two out of ten. Yeah. Like for me, the sweat level, like apex, is like a. Apex is like a sweat level 7 for me. You haven't played since, the, since you worked on it? I, again, I'm I'm tempted to go back into Arena. Get good at it. I, I wish, I wish, I wish I could say I would, uh, oh my god, I want to get good at like, um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. But man, Yu-Gi-Oh! has so many issues right now that it's hard to even, it's hard to even, if you know what I'm saying. It's hard to even. <laughs> Did you play Apex again? <laughs> That's cute. You had a developer account with all the cards active? Ooh, that's cool. I mean, the problem is having all the cards, whatever, using all the cards, and how and know how to use a good to make a good deck. And that's 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 the problem. Only because you have a chess board at home doesn't mean that doesn't make you a chess master, right? I, I guess. But I still have this dream. I will uh, keep up a little bit with uh, Black Desert Online. And when the next season comes out, I really have this dream that I can like maybe convince enough people to try Black Desert Online with me and the boys and friends. And we go to a season server and try our best there. For a season, that would be fun. Oh, Dart is super dead. Right? Oh, that would be fantastic. Mm. Sayo's in too. Desk Cerberus is in too. I know that for a fact. But there's a lot of people that, also, that already said yes. Yeah, Sabo's in too. Oh, man. Sabo will be like in some forest chopping wood all the time. He's like, yeah, I'm doing my part. Chopping wood. I'm like, yeah, good. Like, I can encourage him to chop more wood. That's a fantastic thing. Yeah, yeah, it's like uh, it's like pay to play, like uh, Guild Wars 2. Stay away from my one. <laughs> you just need to get level 30 and 540, and then you'll be hooked. No, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it is so slow. 
I'm dying while playing it. I, I, I feel my body getting older while playing. That's not that's not a good thing, right? <laughs> like my god. Did I age again? Ugh. I'm sorry. What happens with level 30 and Final Fantasy 14 that I would be like, I will never quit the game again? Yes. The story? The story happened. Oh. But what if I finish the story? You know what I mean? Jokes on you! I skipped the story. Oh my god, Hana, are we best friend. Everyone says this. It's, oh my god, there's so many cutscenes. Like, yeah, I agree, I can't. I, again, I try my very best to keep up with it. And I really try, I really give it the benefit of the doubt and try my best. But so far, it's like, oh my god. So hard. It's so hard for me. And you take a break like I do. So. You're not playing the game, you're not playing the MMO, you just play an expendable Final Fantasy solo adventure. <laughs> Aha! And that's a good thing. Yeah, this is what I say about Final Fantasy XIV too. If I want to sit, kick back, relax and just get like, you know, driven away by a story, good game. For me, an MMO needs to be like, I need to be there, I need to slay monsters and gather stuff and, you know, have something. Like, I need, I need gameplay girth. I don't care for the story, I don't want story, I want... Auf Schnauze, it's a German word. I want just go in, bash other player's skulls in, or whatever it is, like, I want to play an MMO. I don't want a story. I don't want a story! <laughs> Avoids instant death. Hmm. Also, you home now? Welcome home. Yeah, I want to sweat in an MMO, exactly. And I, I and I want to play with friends. And I don't want I don't want I, I'm, I'm sorry about this again. Beat any new dragoons. No, we have like a girl in like underwear now in my group. That's cool too, I guess. And they robbed me. Like someone else is a dragoon now. They they robbed my dragoon crystal. You bet she's becoming a dragoon. Yeah, I guess she will become a water dragoon because there was like there was like talk about a sea dragon already. So I guess you're not too far off. But yeah, again, for me in MNO is I want to spend time with friends doing something and not like wait for my friends to get out of a cutscene. That, that's the only issue I have with Final Fantasy XIV. It's just yeah, I would I would hardcore enjoy it if it just would be a pl single player game. But I don't enjoy the MMO part because I don't see myself playing this with other players except like endgame dungeons because everything else is like hardcore solo. And doesn't need other players at all. I feel like other players would be a, in, are a bother. If I see another player in like a city or whatever in Final Fantasy XIV, I would, I'm super rude to them. I like spam emotes, I want to like, I want them to lock off from my story experience. I make them leave the server. This is my story! Get out of here! You don't belong to my cutscene! <laughs> True. 
This is my NPC. I talk to him now. Also, the game is implying, by the way, which I also don't like. I, I played the first quest where, like, there was cutscene and I had to, like, save a Lelafe, or whatever they called, whatever, uh, from, like, a dragon or whatever. Main character syndrome, much? Yep. Um, they, uh, I had to, like, save them from, like, a gargoyle, like, a flying creature or whatever. And there was, like, a dude there, too. And during... During combat, the the character was, like, referred to... Yeah, the Void said, yeah. The character was referred to because the uh, enemy had him in, uh, in the target. He was referred to as Handsome Stranger. And I, th I didn't thought he was handsome, but the game thought I should think he is handsome. So I was like, fuck you. <laughs> I, no. Also, I, 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 I uh, in, in like a tavern, I met like bootleg Auron from Final Fantasy X. Sexy baby. No, thank you. <laughs> Sexy baby. <laughs> He looks better later in the game. I don't care! I don't want the game to imply my feelings. Thank you. He can be a stranger. Joke's on him. He can be like question mark. Oh, it's okay. He's not handsome. I decide who is handsome. Not the game. I read like a steampunk book series a while ago. And it really bothers me in that too. Like... Instead of like describing a place, it was like, yeah, you enter a store uh, and it has very cool stuff in it. That was the description of the place. I don't know what that means. How does the store look? It has very cool stuff in it. Um, oh, oh, really? Cool stuff? What is cool? Like, what is cool? Like, eh. It, pfft, description much? No? <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Stranger name their uh, name their son handsome. Then he is in, then he is uh, then he's like uh, um, obli obliged to like um, introduce himself like that. It could be his legal name. He was like question mark before the fight. That was not his name. And I know his name. His name was Ga whatever. It was not bootleg Oron though. He was in a tavern sitting. Like, I was talking to, like, a dude, like a marauder or whatever, and like, oh my god, and I, and I eyed him. Tancred, yeah, and I eyed, like, I eyed, like, a marauder in, like, some tavern, and uh, I faced him, and then there was, like, a, a dude sitting in a red coat with, like, a super fancy sword, and the marauder was like, oh my god, fancy sword boy? I didn't know who, who that was, but it was bootleg Oron for me. Um... Wait, you don't think Tancred is handsome? I don't think- no! That wrong. I uh, Final Fantasy fans will just kill me. <laughs> the Final Fantasy community was never toxic before. They gather and riot my place. They will like rip every stone out of this pyramid. Fuck you, Ustra. Fuck you and your stupid opinions about my favorite video game of all time. <laughs> there are a lot of fan girls for Tenku. Yes, one just left the stream. <laughs> His name is Eldranus. You guys make me. You guys, you guys make me feel things. The, the boiled up toxicity comes to get me. Yeah. These are the two biggest virtual sim characters. I see. Okay. It's fine, money. Again, I don't like the implication though. Like, he is looking cool, I grant it. I like his tattoo thing, and I like how he looks. But I don't want the game to tell me how I feel about it. In like a, in like a, in like a likable way, right? Right, if like, oh my god, there's a suspicious looking, like a suspicious looking man. Fine, a dangerous looking man, fine. But like, handsome, that implies that I see him as handsome and maybe I don't like boys
I will like or hate whom? Whom? More character name? I, I, you think I will like bother, bother to like remember any of these character names? You're wrong. Again, I'm just playing the MMO to like read. <laughs> uh, have you have you have you guys heard about books? Books? No, 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 no her. Okay. Yeah. Only my the only NPC name I remember is Thomas. Yeah, Guard Thomas from in Elven Forest. I remember him always. It's not even a joke. It's like it's like actually like an NPC I remember. <laughs> it's not a joke. Like, yep, Guard Thomas in Elven Forest, standing guard at the bridge towards the lodging camp. Yep, I know him. My friend, he's my buddy. So many characters passed him. I can't let you go. If we advance, we will have to fight again. I mean, yeah, that's why we're here. The Baker and Storm and Thomas Miller. <laughs> hey, nothing can be done without meeting the Garricks, right? What about Lynn? Darts, Memento, and this Lloyd that you're looking for? Warring won't help. Besides, it might not start to move this time. Oh, too late. Everyone, run! Can I get healed before that? I am very low on HP. Okay. I guess not. Thanks! Oh wow, this is looking very alien. I'm not healed. Oh, that's a problem. Very cool looking design. I have no MP! That's a problem. Wow, that's a handsome boss. If you if you think that way, that's totally on you. That's an okay thing to do. It's an okay thing to say. But you cannot say like, oh my god, Ustra thinks this boss is so handsome. See? That's wrong. That's wrong. You can you you can kiss this boss. Everywhere you want, I don't care. I have one healing potion. This will go. This will go good. I'm reading Feeling Victory here. Mm hmm. I fit everything handsome. I didn't say that it's not handsome. So, wait, not saying anything relies immediately into- <laughs> Yeah, you didn't say it's not, so I guess it is. What? This is not how this works. Oh, it's handsome until it said it isn't. Oh, what? You guys are the worst. I will never share my feelings with you ever again. You brought this upon yourself. I will never share my feelings again. Good to see you, David, by the way. Happy Friday. weekend ahead of me so can't be better four days of gaming yes 
It's hard to fight this boss without uh, my... <gasps> Thank you! You only want to see me in Tingle costume, but I really appreciate it. Did he just stomp me? I love that dude again, please. Hmm, I love that. Ah! Oh, I wanna get stomped. So hard, bro. Thank you for the gifted sub, Subodinda. To Vampire Master 88 Enjoy the sub. And uh, again, thank you. This will bring us closer to the Tingle costume. Four days of Sayu getting you to do the chores, also true. And now two people will die. Oh, I have the angel robe. That's so good. Oh, I'm about to love this game. Yes. Master, thank you so much for uh, for speaking up. Appreciate it. Happy Friday to you. I hope my Final Fantasy conversation was not too bothersome. Usually, I, I let this out of conversations, but these people in here. Oh, I beat them already. Yo. Cool. I'm stronger than I think, I guess. That was not too hard. I had no healing. Shana! Thank you, thank you. Get wrecked, idiot. Thanks for the hydration, too. Shana! What on earth are you? To Virage. I don't know. I don't know anything. There's no more Virage. Dart! It's okay now. I love the close-ups. It's so cool. It's so involving. Like for a game like this, where you think it's like, you know, an older game, they would not... They would not um, zoom in like that. It's cool. I like it. Very charming. This community is way too nice. You guys are all so sweethearts, and I'm I'm here like I'm here like spitting poison into the direction of Final Fantasy XIV. You guys are the most nicest and relaxed people ever. I'm sorry that I bring this topic up. I guess you guys forced me a little bit into this, so it's fine. And I guess I forced myself into it because I just wanted to talk about it, but thank you for enduring me on this beautiful Friday. I really mean this. It's good to have you all here. The power that can awake, uh, awake the sleep of 11,000 years. Is that, uh, is, that, is that Rancor against us? The Rancor against Dragoons awakening the Rirage? Or is that something to do with Shana? You brought a bag of knockoff chocolate on the way home? Shana. Good names. Good names for the same products. After you came back, Dart, a lot of things started to happen. 
But we have to overcome everything and we will continue. Because I'm not alone now. Everyone is with me and I have you, Dart. You make me strong. I can't do it. I can't leave. I can't leave any time. But I wonder if other people can. Are you okay? Thanks to my guiding you, it was totally thrilling, wasn't it? Now we can go straight to the Garrick gang. We can rescue Lin. Garrick gang is straight up ahead. Let's hurry up and rescue Lin. We were safe by Shana. It seems that this is not that simple for her. Ex the existence of dragoons and the existence of virages should have ended 11,000 years ago. But they are brought to life around us. I think we have to go forward to find out more about this. Shana has, has changed. She has obtained more strength. I agree. I don't know what is happening to Shana, but she is trying to solve that alone. Has become a woman. Guess so. It's not the time to talk about this, but it's time for you to change. Me? It's too hard on Shana if you continue to treat her like a mere baby sister forever. Doesn't matter, your dragoon spirit is waiting. We have to think about going. There must be something wrong with Shana. And she must definitely see it. Everybody knows that. Peanut, tasty, and biscuit crunch. I love biscuit. I love biscuit, biscuit crunch. Let's go, everybody. The Gear, the Gearix will be just ahead. Hmm. Did we heal? We didn't even heal from that. Why should we? I love this game. This game is so hard. It's like, oh, we do a little break, like a short rest, didn't even get healed. Crazy. Oh, we just on the world map? Oh, that's a bummer. I will do a break time here real quick and we go for a little bit more. I, you know, I was a little bit low energy earlier, but I'm getting it back. Maybe I got, because I got stuff out about like certain MMOs that will never be a topic in this chat room. See you in just a second. Thank you for hanging around. Thanks again for the generosity. I will roll the dice after the break. If you want to roll your dice too, check your channel points uh, or check other ways to support the stream. Maybe get me in a single costume or get more PlayStation 1 video games. We will see you in just a second. 